Hey loves! So today I'm just going to make a quick video of this bag, which is the Louis Vuitton imprint Nino in Noir color. So I know you guys are all familiar of this bag um, already, but I just, you know, wanted to share it with you um, again. Um, I do have the other, um, the same bag in a different material, which is the monogram canvas. But I thought like I wanted to add another one, but in a different material. Because I find this bag, the imprint one, to be dur really more durable. Um, the only difference between a monogram and this one, it just feels a little heavy. But it's still, uh, you know, you can still tolerate it, I guess. Like you can still wear it without having that uh, weight burden on your shoulder. Um, anyway, so this, see this, it's all leather around. And this is a 2020 year bag, which, uh, you know, I bought it this year. And um, the inside, I ordered the Samorga insert already, so it doesn't get um, dirty or dusty inside a bag. And it's the exact same features and uh, details as you know the same as the canvas ones like bend azure and monogram it has that division and uh, you know that middle uh, compartment and also um the inside by the way i forgot to tell you it's like a suede leather so that added uh, more weight uh, to the bag but like i said it's not too bad um it's gold there's you know gold hardware and also it comes with a um, cross body uh, strap and the difference between this and the regular canvas um, Nino you know bag is the separate you know handle i like it if you just wanted to put it on your um you know on your arms and you could carry it, carry it that way but all of my bags like i've always prefer them to wear it cross body because um they're hands free you know, it's a carefree bag. Um, I'm gonna show you later like how it looks or how big it looks when you wear it. And yeah, so yep, overall, I really like this bag. Like I said, it's something that would last for about a de decade or so because it's really a workhorse bag. It's really, really quality made. Um, and uh, it's, it's really nice. The leather is really soft, like you would, you wouldn't even see wrinkles even if you like squish it like that you know squeeze it like that but the only downside about this bag is it didn't come with a bottom feet i wish um louis vuitton but you know the four bottom um metal feet so then it's gonna um protect the bottom of this bag from getting robbed or, or you know scratch or something um especially for this bag which costed about 2700 retail plus tax it's going to cost you an easy uh three thousand dollars but yeah so anyway here you go i'm going to go ahead and wear it and you know i'm going to show you how big it looks so i'm uh five my son is right there say hi <laughs> so i am five uh five two in height so here you go this is how it looks yep um it's not too big it's not too small it's just perfect and you can still put all your you know daily essentials inside it's still pretty spacious you can put your uh little tablet or i guess um your notebook the air one uh, the mac air and it's still gonna fit in there and like i said it's really nice you can also wear this as a crossbody you just have to um i just this strap right here but it's still gonna it's gonna be right up here which is still not bad you know but anyway all right it's really nice thing mm -hmm.